My name is Dennis Isizo. I'm the auxiliary bishop of our child diocese. I, not talk, I do not talk about elevation. I talk about reassignment. I was reassigned, given another place to work. So I'm trying to do my work, and uh, it's going on well. We thank God. We sow the seed. The Lord makes the seed germinate and makes the seed grow. Well, <laughs> to start with, when I was in the minor seminary, I started with the first group of brothers of St. Stephen. So all the first group to profess the brothers of St. Stephen, I was with them in the class in the in Ohio Seminary for the period of our formation in the secondary school. And then since then, one way or the other, I've been connected with the brothers. I worked and lived with Canada Lorenzo, their founder. And then I lived with the brothers in Rome. And since I came back, I've been with them. So throughout my life, I've been connected with them. And they say that I'm even an associate member, and I accept that. Canarinze is an extraordinary man. Extraordinary in every sense. For me, he's an ideal priest. Because living with him, I learned a lot about priesthood. He's very, very simple. You can predict his own action. He lived as a transparent man, a holy man. Traveling with him, he prays always. He's always having his rosary. He prays always. And in the house, you can program his life. Chapel, Walk, meal, chapel, bed, that's his own style. So he's always a man of prayer. And then, uh, in relating with other people, he's precise. You know where he stands on issues. And he talks about the faith with clarity. It's like an elephant. Any part you touch, you have something to talk about. The brothers are teachers, the brothers are catechists, that's what we are asked to do. The Pope is the number one catechist, and the brothers are doing the same work. We are called to evangelize, Christ sent us on a mission, go announce the good news to the whole world. And that's what we are doing, the brothers are engaged, and the brothers are involved in every part. In, now, in Nigeria here, yeah, there are many places working. So they participate in the work of evangelization actively. I stayed in the church, let them look, look around to see the people that came to them. First of all, these people, all of them gathered, they are praying for them. And they wish them well, they want them to succeed. Let their presence today be an encouragement. It's not easy to be a brother, to move from level one to level two in Christian life. They are committed their whole life to God. And then the first challenge is in our society. People are immediately identify and praise and work with priests.